Hey guys, today we're making a spaceship earth cake. We're gonna start with this sphere shaped mold that I got at Michael's. It has these little things to rest on. It suggests that you use shortening instead of butter or spray. This is floating. Alexa, if an egg is floating, is it good or bad? Egg floats on the surface. It is bad and should be discarded. Okay, now let's get started. All right, and then these will bake for about 45 minutes or 48, I think is what it took mine. While that's baking, I've prepared some Rice Krispie treats, all about the same size, and I tested it to see if it would stand. I did four pieces, and it seems to be pretty sturdy, so we can move on. What I'm doing next is just cutting strips of black fondant so that we can um, cover these and we'll just wrap these up like they're little burritos or I guess kind of like sushi, kind of rolling them up. <laughs> and I just do that with all four, cut off the excess and then we'll just brush off the rest of the powdered sugar. Okay, these just came out. Oh, it's getting hot. There's like a hole in here somewhere that I could feel it. Didn't like that. So the cake is out, it's still cooling. Now I was just testing this out cause I wanted to see what it looked like. But you can see that we're gonna have to cut right here like on the line. Okay, so this is what I'm thinking. I think I'm gonna do like an inch size triangles and then we'll do the inner triangles. We're just gonna make a bunch. We won't stop, we won't sleep. Not until it's complete. <laughs> and we're back to rolling some more fondant. And these were about an inch thick. Oops. <laughs> and now the tedious process of cutting triangles begins with just four right now. So I'm just gonna do that for all the rest of them. 30, no, this is probably, so that's 28. 30, 32, 34, 36, 38, 40, 42, 44, 45, 45. So that was, that was a good one. All right, so we're just cutting some more triangles right now. So the plan is I'm going to do these triangles, make a little triangle on the inside, more triangles, and just have a bunch of little triangles within a triangle. <laughs> Lots of triangles, basically. Okay. This is what we're looking at. This is one. Um, so I might be good. But I'll just cut the rest of these and figure out from there. But this is what it's going to look like so far. Two down. Um, I'll show you how I'm doing these. I'm not cutting all the way through. So I'm just doing that same process that I showed in that like drawn model on my phone that I did. And we're just doing that starting with that first triangle in the middle. I think that's the easiest way to do it. And then going in from each corner and then connecting them from the shaky seat copy. And then you just do that like 99 times and then you're done. And of course I won't make you watch me do this 99 times, but I did want to show you the first one in case you decide you want to do this. This is what this looks like. And it did take a very long time. <laughs> okay, so you can see how that's gonna be a process. So here, I'm just cutting an angle uh, of each of the legs, I guess, and we're sticking a lollipop stick into them. We'll add chocolate later to help secure it better and uh, make sure it doesn't collapse because this is a very dense Epcot ball. We need this to stand. 
I was actually very nervous that this wasn't going to be able to hold up, but uh, later I'm going to end up adding reinforcement. And now we wait and see if it dries properly. I've stood them up with chocolate. I put a little base right here and some frosting to hopefully stick and these lollipop sticks and spray paint it and it should be done after that. Here you go. Oh, I don't like that. There's not much we can do though. What do I do? Just go with it? You're not helping. I'm an artiste. Do I still film this? I guess. It's not too bad. I don't mind that. What? It's just this part that took 25 hours to make. Let me keep spraying? Mm, no, we're just, we can just do this. I need to grab another brush. She even grab a brush. <laughs> No. Like purplish. You know, I don't hate the way it looks with splatters. Well, that's it. That's all you got. You only have to do one side. That's what I'm thinking too. <laughs> <laughs> Dang, this color is perfect. No, we have over here sucks. I'm gonna Here, I got this. One more. One more. One Try more. Try over here. No, nothing. Can we done? No. What? And we pretty much just paint until it's done. I think we were using like three different colors and that spray that you saw that we used. And it kind of came out cool because it gave it more depth. Um, this part was so fun. So highly recommend. Did that do anything? No. Just <laughs> <laughs> go get more paint. And that's exactly what I went to do. I went to Tar- Digo, no, sorry. I went to Walmart, went and grabbed another little spray can of metallic silver, sprayed the rest of it, went over it with a little bit more paint. You can see that I shortened the legs a little bit. I didn't want to, it was really risky, but we did. It's like it could be the Death Star almost. And there it is, the Spaceship Earth cake is complete. I posted a video on Instagram of me actually cutting into the cake, so if you're not following me there, you can check out that video. It's pretty satisfying. Thank you for watching. I hope you have an amazing day. Bye.